Let's go fossil collecting through to the east of Lyme Regis. Always a really nice sight to see these big ammonites down here on the beach. I've stopped here looking for a bellum light you can see down here in the water. This is a good size one for this uh, particular neck of the woods here out at Black Ven. There's the fragma comb where the creature lived right up to the sharp point. Well, I've been finding quite a few topstone nodules today and maybe an ammonite there, an impression of an ammonite to give the game away. There might be something more inside the stone. So let's have a look at these. Let's tap at these and see what happens. A lovely sunny afternoon in the middle of November. Well, I've just stumbled upon a sea urchin block. I was collecting these little bits of fossiliferous material. You can see here the layered limestone rocks. And it's a shame how worn some of those ammonites are in that material. And I'll have a tap at them anyway, just to show you about them. But here you can see all those sea urchins in that large block there. Look how big the block is. And you can see that little one popping out of the edge there. Well, I wouldn't normally hit flint without safety spectacles on. You can see one sea urchin there protruding out of the rock. So that's going to be nice to tap at right on top of the flat surface here. There you go, you see a nice bulbous sea urchin. Fossil sea urchin from the Cretaceous period. Well, let's go sieving away on this quite stormy day here in the middle of November. Let's see what we've got. Just pour through all the material. Bit of, big bit of iron pyrite. Uh, yeah, big, oh, little one there. It's damaged, all right, look at that. It's not a pyrite ammonite, that's what I was going for, it's the pyrite ammonites, but that's damaged. It's been uh, chipped out of a rock and then landed in the beach area. What a lovely sunny afternoon and some nice flat boulders to sit on.
lovely afternoon in mid-November, no one around on the beaches. So I found this nice ammonite, you can see the back of it just protruding out there. Let's line it up, try and get some of the material off the back, create a flat face to tap down through towards the ammonite. baby one there. Let's try and get this other ammonite out. Just see it in there, nice greeny colour. Seems to be a crack running round the outer edge. There's the top of it going right through. Should be able to take some of that off. There's the keel of it sticking out. Nice green translucent ammonite there. I'll take that back and prepare it. It's a big yellow stone here on the beach. Nicely layered rock. That's induced the crack through the rock. Let's have a look. Ah, there's a little one, the edge of one protruding out there. Nice bump, that'll prepare nicely. Look at that in the evening sun, a really large lump of the fossil wood monkey puzzle tree. It's always important to get back to Lyme Regis before the sea cuts you off at these steps that get you back onto the new seawall.